um, in the last episode we did beef uh, short rib and then we used the sesame uh, leaf and then we wrapped it with some either fermented pepper paste or um, soybean uh, sauce and a little bit of uh, bell pepper that we grilled. Now, next thing we're going to do is going to be belly. So this is thinly sliced pork belly. Oh, it sticks, but that's fine because there's fat that's going to melt. So the fat is going to melt. <laughs> fat is going to melt. And the porter is here, of course, he's checking the progress of our work, right, porter? See all the smoke porter. Right here, checking the progress of our work. Oh, we should put some salt over there. See, only the first round is going to stick, but the second one is not. How to or how not to. Okay, see this? Got a little crispy. I think it's ready. See, I do like pork belly, but not a big fan of the thicker cut has tears. Shit, I fell in my eye. I mean oil. <laughs> oil. Yeah. Water. What's up? All right, so we're going to take the leaf, pepper paste maybe, fermented pepper paste. And one of the bell peppers that we did earlier. Then you just wrap this. See? Okay. Mmm, very, very good. Okay, you can do it. All right, it's okay. We'll we'll make it better. How about now, Porter? Huh? Okay. So now we have this. Now I have to try the pepper with pork belly. We'll see how that goes. Oh, hot. Hmm. Needs salt. So, a pepper and a piece of meat. But you know what, we'll try to also wrap this inside the leaf now. The whole theme here is this using the leaf. Oh, mmm, mmm, this is so good. Mm. I'm loving it. Sweetness and juiciness from the pepper. Um, when you're kind of salty of the flavor from the crunchy um, pork belly and then the leaf that cleans your palate mm, fragrance it's just really good I mean just really good a simple mm, cheers between the last episode and this one when we tried the short rib and then now uh, the belly I think the short rib is a little better you know? I think it's too, but I like beef better than pork. 
Yeah, I'm trying to be objective for the viewers because I know some of you probably like pork more, some of you like beef more. There are pro pros and cons with both. One is, uh, I mean, the pork belly is crunchier, and um, they're both good actually. They're just they're they're really good, right, Porter? Well, I'm glad Porter is here because he's helping me. He's helping me eat all of this. I mean, we always need someone to help you eat, and he's here. He's a good Aww. companion. Never complains about my cooking. Never so far. Uh, we have a good, good. Um... What about me? Now the leaf. He's going to. He's going to use the leaf as a plate. You know. So that's my producer. We got, we got a lot of business deals and offers. Look at this. This is good, Porter. All right, give me one more. On your plate. Right here. See? Look at this, guys. He really liked this. His, this is, his whole life is about being humble, being happy with small things. I think one thing we can learn from our pets, uh, companions, is being happy with small things. You don't need millions of dollars to be happy. You can be happy with a piece of pork belly, right? Or pepper. It's good stuff. So, mm, it's really good. So guys, it's not about destination. It's about the journey, okay? He's like, shut up and give me some more pork. Okay, I'll make your dreams come true. His plate is all yucky. He's slimed all over it. But that's fine anyway in the next episode we will be doing something totally different stay tuned Mwah. bye cheers <laughs>